their correlation might get wider generalities. His criticism of principles must chiefly take the form of determining the proper meaning to be assigned to the fundamental notions of the various sciences, but these notions are considered in respect to their status relative to each other. The determination of this status requires a generality transcending any special subject matter. If we may trust the Pythagorean tradition, the rise of European philosophy was largely promoted by the development of mathematics into a science of abstract generality. But in its subsequent development the method of philosophy has also been vitiated by the example of math philematics. The primary method of mathematics is deduction. The primary method of philosophy is the script F-16 type generalization. Under the Intilda's influence of mathematics, deduction has been foisted onto philosophy as its standard method, instead of taking its strict place as an essential auxiliary mode of verification whereby to test the scope of generality. This Intilda apprehension of philosophic method has failed a very considerable subtle sense of philosophy in providing generic notions to our apprehension of the facts of experience. The depositions of Plato, Aristotle, Secularist Philosophy, 11 Thomas Aquinas, Descartes, Spinoza, Leibniz, Telog, Berkeley, Hume, Kant, and Hegel, merely mean that ideas which these men introduced into the philosophic tradition must be